What's up guys, this is Mr. X-Men450, this is like the 5th or 4th or something like that time I'm doing this video, because I keep messing it up. <laughs> um, I think I've learned my lesson on what not to do, I don't know if this is exactly the problem or not. But anyways, uh, what you're going to need to do right off the bat is uh, get on your PS3, make sure you uh, have your USB drive plugged into there. Go to your save data utility under the game subject dealio where your game is going to be when you put it in. Um, go ahead and just click save data utility. Uh, go to, there should be your cruiser guide and then uh, go down into the games, find your MW3. It should say, if you stay on it for a couple seconds, it should say save game and player profile. So just click copy on that, uh, or triangle, copy, and then uh, select your cruiser guide. Uh, yes, to make sure that that is copied on there. Then just go ahead and unplug it once it's copied. So you, from that, you're going to get this. Your removable disk, you're going to have this. So, yeah, you don't need that right now. Um, I'm going to link this in there into my... <clears throat> I'm going to link this, everything you need for your save, into my uh, uh, description. So go ahead and open this up. Go to your PS3 designer. Open that. Go ahead and open up your hex editor. Okay. Next out of this, go ahead and open up your designer again. File open. Go ahead and go straight to where, um, for you guys, it's going to be, um, hold on, desktop. For you guys, before um, you're going to get this file. Uh, it's actually going to be, um, I can't remember what the stuff's called. Never mind. Um, but once you take it out, it's going to be a file. Um, it's going to be everything for your save. You're going to open it up, go to your YouTube. YouTube saves and then inside of it is going to be your one that says rainbow lol just click on that one I usually just take the rainbow lol one out just so I have it right there when I need it and then uh, you're gonna want to click on the blus uh, GPA do cm p it's a PRF file so go ahead and open that up uh, click cancel go ahead and click decrypt game save Okay, so there you go. It's decrypted. Now you can just put that down. Don't X that out. Open up your hex editor. Go ahead and go to file open. And then um, you're just going to go back to your desktop where this rainbows file is or in your everything for save. You just got to go into this file. There's going to be a decrypted saves folder right there. Open that up. Go to this. Go to your GPADO CM again, the PRF file. Open that up. And then here is your code stuff. So I'm actually just going to change this a little bit so that I don't have to mess it up again. Um, I, oh, jeez, I don't know what to put again. Okay, so you know what? I'm just going to do my, I'm just going to do custom titles or something like that. So let's open up. Also, we have our color codes, all that stuff. You have the X up the, actually, you know what? I'm going to test out the X right now. Make sure that works. I'm going to do control C on the X. And then you just uh, X this out because I already have it. Um, right here, right away, I'm just going to... Oopsies. We're going to... I don't know what to do here. Okay, so then it's going to come in as a dot. So there you go. So that's going to be your X. And then I'm going to do... What color do I want? I'm going to do green. So that's carrot 2. Carrot two, and then I'm gonna do Christmas or something like that, you know. Shift C H R I S T. I don't know how to spell Christmas. I think that's how you spell Christmas. <laughs> okay, so Christmas, and then we'll just do carrot. I think red is one. Let's do one. Christmas cheer. And then we'll do um, a green heart or something like that, just because I don't care. Uh, so that's going to be carrot 2, and then you're just going to do that, that. There we go. And then you can click space to get that S off of there so it's not on there. And then um, your title is going to be right here. I mean, your clan tag is going to be right there. All you got to do is just uh, change whatever color you want it to be. I want mine to be green. And then I'm just going to do, um, 
Yeah. Yeah, uh, you know what? I'll just leave the smiley face on there. Yeah. No, actually, you know what? I'll do this. Just to test it out. We'll just copy my X again. Actually, I think it's already copied. Yeah, so control V, control V. So, actually, the color code doesn't even matter right now. I don't even need a color code in this. Okay, so I have a color code anyways. It doesn't matter. You don't need that. So, um, I have that saved now, right? Okay, so right here is your clan tag, which is the four letters. Oopsies, sorry. It's actually um, different. But anyways, this is the first character of your clan tag, even though it's not going to show. You're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the seventh one right here is what you, the background is going to be. So mine's 2A right now, which I'll show you which one that is, which it's the rainbow one. Um, it's uh, so intense. Yeah, so I don't know what a green and red one would be. So we'll do we'll do I don't know. Oh, you know what? We'll just do the first one zero zero. Yeah. So that's like the camo. Uh, so then you just type zero zero. Okay. So there you go. That's uh, that's that. So then all you gotta do is just click save. Um, other stuff up here is um, your like sensitivity is going to be set to 15. Um, all you got to do in the game is just change it back um, and then change your HUD. That's going to be messed up too. So then just put that down. Open up your PS3 folder again and here's where you got to mess with this. So just pull this down here to the right. Open up your everything for save. Your PS3 designer again. Just click out X out of that. Alrighty, so now all you gotta do is open up your PS3 folder where you act. This one's actually the one off your PS3. Um, I didn't get that when I was watching videos on how to do this. That this one is actually off your PS3. So open that up, and it's the same file we've been using. And then it's gonna pop up cancel. And then just uh, Control C, copy that, and then paste it right there. Okay, so this one. You can just uh, delete that, copy this, paste here. Oops. What? Control V. Okay, there we go. So now that it's copied and everything, just um, yeah. So here you go. We can delete this one out. Um, this is the one that um, is hacked. The other one was the uh, actual thing. So encrypt and resign. You just click on that. Thank you. It worked. Finally, I have a video of one actually working. <laughs> All right, so game save resigned. Okay, so then once you have that done, you can just uh, X out of everything. Your hex editor. Uh, cancel. Close. Okay, there we go. So now you can just open up your rainbows file. There's going to be these two files, which is your original backup. I'm going to keep that. You don't have to keep that. You can delete that. But then you're going to have to re get the file and everything because it's not going to be in your everything for save. So I'm going to keep the original backup just so I have it. Okay, so there's no space after that. So then, um, yeah, so you can delete this, your decrypt save folders. This is the one you're actually going to use. So go ahead and just drag that. Actually, you know what? No, don't drag that. Um, go to your removable disk, PS3, save data, and then just click on this one and delete it. And then you can just go right back to where you were. Um, desktop, rainbows, and then open. take this one, drag it to here. Uh, PS3, save data. So it's going into my save data right now. So now if I open this up, PS3, save data. Bless Auto. This is the hacked one. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, all you got to do is X out and then uh, eject your cruiser guide. You probably know how to do that. Actually, I don't think you have to, but it's recommended. So now I'm going to pull that out. And actually, while I'm talking, I'm going to open it up on here because I can't really show you what I'm doing. But I can post a picture on it of the end of what it looks like. So now I'm just going to go ahead and once it's in here, I'm going to go to Save Data Utility again. Go to a USB device. Mine's a cruiser guide, so I just click on that. 
And then my Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 save game and player profile is in here. So I just hit triangle, click copy, click uh, yes. Yes, I want to overwrite. Overwrite, not ride. Overwrite. Okay, there we go. So now we do have it set up. Now all I got to do is click uh, on my Call of Duty to start. Oh, sorry, to start the game. Do 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 All right, guys. Um, while I'm waiting, go ahead and uh, make sure you hit that likes and subscribe if you like this video. Um, check out some of my other videos. I'm gonna be doing this a lot more. Uh, hopefully, hopefully I'll be getting a Joe Broken PS3 also so that I can mess with all this stuff. So um, there we go. Okay, so once you go into multiplayer, your multiplayer you're going to notice is going to be 1,100% complete instead of what it actually is. So go ahead and just uh, connect to the online services, play online. Um, actually, I'm not sure if this works on Xbox, guys. If it does, uh, then I honestly, I don't have an Xbox. I can't really show you how it's done. Oh, and yes, the, uh, the X has actually worked. Sweet. Okay, so the X is I do no work now. All right. So um, I'm just going to go ahead and take a picture of this for you guys and uh, slap it up on the screen there and show you. Um, thanks for watching again. Um, I really appreciate you guys watching my videos. I don't have very many subscribers or viewers at all, so um, hopefully this video will boost it a little bit. Uh, make sure you share this with your friends so that uh, so that they can learn how to do this. Also, um, I will put the stuff in the description for you and... Uh, Make sure you guys, um, if you are having problems, you can comment or you can message me on YouTube. Just don't be afraid to message me and I will help you out. Um, I'm actually trying to work on a method right now to do uh, other people's profiles. Uh, actually via email where they just email me the profile or the profile, the save data and stuff like that. And then I just uh, edit it, send it back to them. And then, uh, yeah just that way. Also, I can just make a, an edited uh, file for you and then uh, send that to you and you can put it on just the right way. So, um, yeah. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you later. Uh, yeah, thanks. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Mr. X-Men 450. Again, I just, uh, instead of doing my outro this time, I think I'm going to make this video really quick. And uh, I just want to tell you guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. Um, I'm actually going to start um, doing more of this stuff if I can. Uh, I have a little bit more time on my hands nowadays, so yeah. Anyways, uh, please check out my uh, channel. If you have any problems, just uh, message me on uh, YouTube or uh, comment on this video. That's great. Um, I'm off, I'm gonna put an annotation to my channel, probably like there. <laughs> and then uh, yeah, just check that out. I also have my uh, Facebook. Um, you can just find that on Facebook if you want to. So thanks.